let's make 90 degree helical gear mechanism in SolidWorks so open file new and here directly we will go to assembly so click ok now cancel this and uh, go to design library see here tools in tools matrix power transmission gear and helical gear so just drag one gear here okay now here we will edit gear module we will keep three this is pre-calculated number of teeth we will make 15 right hand helix direction and we will keep 45 degree in one gear and 45 degree in another gear so it becomes 90 degree pressure angle we will keep 20 now face width let's say 22 and here hub style uh, we will keep none shaft diameter 25 and here we will add one rectangle one a rectangle key okay rest keep as it is and say okay once you say okay it will ask you do you want more piece yes we, we want one more piece so click and click here cancel now here we have two pieces now right click and see this is fixed so click floating now this is going to float both now first we have to fix first one this is the first one now from here activate temporary axis look this is important mat go to standard and I am going to select right plane and select this face and just turn and see this is exactly met here but we want to fix this at the center of plane so what is the width 22 so we will fix at center so apply dimension or distance and this distance let's say 11 millimeter oh that's perfect now say ok now let's add few more relations now here I am again going to select axis front plane see it is adjusted itself ok then again axis and this time I am going to select top plane and see again it adjusted say ok now if you see this is going to rotate look at own axis okay let's do one thing let's do for this now for this now select this face front plane just check this we want to add at center of this so I am going to add distance 22 divided by is 11 but this is going to reverse direction so here we will change few important thing flip okay okay now let's do some more important relation top plane axis now here we are going to allocate distance so distance 63.64 this is the pitch circular diameter okay again axis right plane coincident relation okay now let me adjust the gear we will try to avoid the collision now this time I am going to activate 
drop down and here you will see teeth cut show now this center one line this outer one is outer diameter this is this is the pitch diameter going for mat mechanical mat gear let me select this one you will see 63.64 the diameter similarly here here also shows 63.64 now you will see say okay cancel now let's rotate now look how the gear is going to rotate and this is perfectly going to rotate now simply hide even though you can hide this hide temporary axis isometric view right click okay let me save this one save all yes now here already there i'll choose mechanic one save save right click toolbar motion manager now here activate i'll keep animation because this is simple first motion study properties i am going to make 50 frame so that we will get a smooth operation now next operation is motor motor type click motor rotary, rotary motor component i am directly going to select this one and see this is going to be clockwise this is what i like and uh, here rpm constant speed 10 rpm i am going to keep say okay and simply i am going to click calculate now see this is going to calculate once it is calculate it will now okay like this now play now see this is how we make a 90 degree helical gear in solidworks with the help of uh, design library i hope you like it don't forget to share and like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solidworks thanks for watching